Hello, hello everybody. So I would like to start with a thank to the French rugby team because they will not be able to beat England tomorrow. <laughs> okay. So um, this, this presentation is to explain what we do in the company H5 Audit. The, the vision, the mission, the customer and partner we are working with, and talk a little bit about network performance intelligence. So H5 Audit is a French company, so we are making software things to nine. So we are making probes and NetFlow as flow collectors. So in, we have 10 gig, 40 gig uh, solution to be able to look at the traffic. We have different customers all over Europe, but most of the customers at the moment are based in France. We have companies like Thales in Space, Airbus Defense and Space. We are working with companies, you must know in France, Decathlon, Generali, Sanofi, this kind of company. And different telco and public companies. So our vision is to be able to provide to enterprise service provider governmental organization, a global network performance intelligence. That means we need, when there is an issue on the network, to have a quick, accessible, and comprehensive IT visibility. So we do it with different customers. We have ATOS, NXO, Airbus, and so on, but different ones. And we are working for, with three different people. One is the IT managers. Because when there is an issue on the network, when there's something wrong, when everything, you need to, to give information to the main people in the company to take the right decision, to make the right decision, and to improve the collaboration within IT teams, especially when there is an issue. It's always a network issue. So the guys from the networks need to explain what's going on and on. And he needs to be able to track and have information about the SLI reporting because this guy needs to give information to the uh, different people in the company, to the COMEX and other people. This is the first guy. The second guy, network engineers. When, when there is an issue in, a, in the IT, it's always a network issue. Are you, are you, do you agree with that? OK. So these guys, if he doesn't have any tools, he cannot improve the infrastructure, it cannot fix the problem. So we need to give them information about if there is an issue, is it a network issue or is it an application issue? Because if it's an issue, it has to be fixed. If it's a network issue on the network, and if it's an application, it needs to discuss with the guys in charge of the application. And this has to be done under pressure because problem issue, everybody needs to say, you need to fix the problem, you need to fix the problem. It's always the same problem, all the company all over the world. Network engineers and the other people we have, it is the guys in charge of monitoring. Okay, the people in charge of monitoring, they have different tools. They can use Zabbix or other tools, but they have to, to have a lot of information. So what they need, they need to have information about uh, alerting. It can be trap, it can be different alerts. And they have, to, they have dedicated dashboards so they need to be informed on that. So our job is to offer to people in the company, to the IT managers, to the network engineers, to the guys in charge of monitoring and the people in charge of business, a unique business flow reporting solutions, okay, based on the network. So how does it work? So we provide metrics and the volume. So we look at the traffic and we say there is this IP, this protocol, and we do a lot of, produce a lot of metrics about the network. We have IP, we have IP per, we have information per site, we have information for URL for everything on the volume. We have also um, performance metrics. So performance metrics can be the latency on the network between two sites, it can be the packet loss, you can see different things. Some of them are for the network, and the other one are for the application. So with this application metrics, the guys in the company, the IT manager or the network engineers can, can see what is wrong, 
because if there is a problem with the jitter, with the packet loss, the, the customer will have problems and the company will have problems with the voice over IP, for example, but if there are latency problems on the site, on a link and something, maybe it will, be, it will have to uh, have a conversation or open etiquette with the telco. Okay, so this is the second point. And the third point, as we are making probes, we can make packet capture on a big buffer and give the trace when there is an issue to the people in charge of the troubleshooting. This is what we do. Okay, for that? So, we have different, um, different products available. One range of product is called H5Flow, which is a NetFlow SFlow collectors. So, this is the first range of product we have. So, we can follow traffic from 50K to 500,000 um, flow per second. So that means if you have a, uh, a network where you want to get the information from NetFlow traffic, from the NetFlow or, for, or from the SFlow traffic, you can send the traffic to an, an appliance, a think for appliance, and will produce the metrics about the NetFlow for you. And the second range of product is our appliance. So appliance name is Probe. So we have Probe from 100 meg to 40 meg. So we have different ways to access to this information. OK? One is the Java GUI. So we, can, we have all the metrics stored in the database. And this matrix can be uh, accessed with the GUI Java. This is the first way. This is very useful when we want to do troubleshooting on the network. And this is very quick. And tomorrow morning, we have a presentation and a workshop, and we'll show on how we do with this product. And if you want to go on the booth, we have an online system, and we can make a demo for you on the booth. <laughs> The second one to access the data, to access the metrics, is the H5 the perf, the H5 reporting portal, which is a full web Angular Node.js portal, which access to the different data in, in, the, in, the, in our systems. And the third way to access the data is Zabbix. Okay? So that means we developed uh, connectors to go into the database of Zabbix and to get all this information available in, uh, in, uh, in Zabbix. So that means if you want to have information about what is running on the network, who is using the application, what is the response time between the different sites, if you want to have information about what is, uh, uh, which application are used on the network, uh, application based in the web, for example, so we can have a list of all the URL, HTTPS URL, uh, on that, and send all this information to Zabbix. Let me show you, so, on that, so this is a, the Java GUI, so you can see there is the Total traffic with the bandwidth in, bandwidth out, volume, volume in, volume, or TT in, or TT out. So we have 70 metrics available per IP, per conversations. So in the, in the Java, you can click on that and click on the TCP, click on SSH, and see all the application that. And you can drag and drop all that into the graphic. And if there is a saturation, you see the saturation over there, so you can click on that zoom on this, on this saturation and see who are the IP which generate the traffic. Okay? So we switch, we switch from table to chart in second, and you can do the other side. And you can zoom on all metrics with one minute of granularity during 30 days. So get, I mean, during the 30 days, you can go back in the database and go where the but today, you want to have a look on, the, on the, the same traffic maybe three weeks ago. You can go back in the past and give the same granularity of one minute. So you can click on all table and, go, and, and, give this, and get this information. 
If, if you want to, to, to send information to different people in the company, especially project manager or other people, you can use the portals. So you can distribute a report across, across the organization. That means uh, if you are a telco, or if you are a roster, or if you are a big company, and you want to um, decide which report, uh, what, what is the report I want to send to the IT manager in charge of the telephony and the other, on the other guys, uh, for the guys in charge of the telco contract and so on. So you can choose the report and make your proper report and send this report to the people in the company. And the other way is called the Zabbix integration. So you know Zabbix because everybody here knows Zabbix, okay? So you can make specific report with the metrics available from H5, so 70 different metrics. And you can take other of these metrics and put these metrics into Zabbix. So you can put table, uh, pie chart, on bar chart, and you can make some kind of table. This one is the one side one, one side two, one side three, one side four, and you get here the network delay, you get the packet loss, and you can do a zoom on that, and as soon as you do a zoom of that, everything will be populated. Okay? So, um, all these metrics uh, can be accessed into, can be, can, can be obtained by the network probes, H5 probes. So we have solution from 100 meg to 40 gig for the probes. And for the NetFlow, which is NetFlow SFlow, the product name is called H5 Flow, we have uh, collectors, which is uh, H5 Flow collectors. And these collectors can be virtual or physical. So if, if you have a VMware environments, we can give you a virtual appliance. You put that into your virtual environments, and we use H5 Flow as a NetFlow collectors. So we, we, you will be able for that to put to send all these metrics into Zabbix. So we have few. We had in the last two months or three months a lot of contact with Zabbix customer who are interested in getting information um, from NetFlow and SFlow, and so you know now you can do it with us. So, if you want to, to know more about our solutions, so you can um, uh, see, see us on the booth. So we can, you, we can make a demo for you and show how, it's, how the application of this solution works with the Java, with the web, or with Zabbix. So we have a real-time uh, solution with real metrics, it's not uh, video, so we connect to the database in real time, so we can ask to you, give you information if you want to have more information. And tomorrow morning, we have, we have a work workshop, it's uh, 8.45 or 8.30, 30, it should be 30. So with, uh, Lionel will manage the workshop, because I will not be too I will not be available tomorrow because this is my wife's birthday, and I, when I booked my ticket, I forgot, and I have to go back tomorrow morning at home. She's 50. Okay, so thank you very much. Feel free to contact us and to, to send us all the questions. Thank you very much.